hometown Cincinnati girl who now lives down here in Houston. And let's just say she is ready for tomorrow's rematch. Erin Doctor moved from Anderson Township to Houston four years ago, but that has not tamed her passion for her hometown team at all. Forever. Die hard. Will never change. From her walls to her wine glass, you can feel the Bengals' pride been this way her entire life. It's painful. It, it, it's, it's very painful at times. It's excruciating, actually, but yeah, you can't stop. That's the bandwagon, people. Erin says it's her passion for football that made her husband fall in love with her. Oh, uh, love you till no. next weekend. Love you till we win. <laughs> Only problem is, he's a Broncos fan. You know, the team the Bengals will have to face next if they win tomorrow. At first, it was unfortunate. Now it's just uncomfortable. After four years of calling Houston home, Erin hasn't found one Bengals fan down here. <laughs> what, you, what is this? Your face. Oh. <laughs> Best Texas tailgate last year. Uh, same thing's gonna happen like last year, and you're gonna go home and your playoff run again in Houston. Yeah, there's not a lot of Bengals love down in Texas for this Cincinnati girl. Who's gonna win? Who did? Bengals! There you go. But she's not afraid, just ready for revenge and a rivalry in her own home next week. One game at a time, though. We gotta beat the Texans. She was so much fun today. Now, so far, Erin and her husband do not have tickets to tomorrow's game. They're running around $200 for first level, but I have a feeling she's going to be getting that ticket sometime tonight, making sure she's in there tomorrow. Coming up tonight at 6 o'clock, I found another exciting person, a Cincinnati girl. She's actually a local DJ, and she is talking trash.